If you eat out all the time, you probably don't have such a great idea of what you're eating. Does that chicken come from Tupelo? Does that potato come from Boise? But on average, millennials spend 45% of their food expenditure outside of the home, which is more than any previous generation. That food is also probably less healthy for you. But the more you cook at home, the more aware you are of where your food comes from and what exactly you're eating. And that's a really important step toward eating more sustainably. But it takes a lot of time to cook and effort to figure out what you want to cook. And have you ever bought a whole head of celery for a particularly ambitious recipe just to use one stock for yourself? Well, there are these meal delivery services that will give you all the ingredients for your meal, virtually eliminating food waste and also, ideally, getting you into a kitchen and out of the restaurant. They're extremely popular, at least with venture capitalists. Blue Apron, for example, is valued at $2 billion and HelloFresh at $2.9 billion. So we decided to try them out to see if this would influence us to want to cook more for ourselves. And as an extra challenge, we ordered all vegetarian and vegan kits. So here are the options that we tried. Blue Apron is probably the most well-known meal kit delivery service. It's based in New York City, and they do make some effort to introduce their customers to the farmers that they source from. Sun Basket is based in California and delivers primarily to the western side of the United States. They source from farmers from the west coast in Mexico, and they do a lot of work to make their packaging more sustainable. Basically, you have to send it back to them for them to clean it and reuse it. HelloFresh is a German meal kit delivery service that started to deliver in the US, and it's also based in New York. Purple Carrot is a Boston-based vegan meal kit delivery service with recipes designed by Mark Bittman. So we decided to rank them. Coming in first was Purple Carrot. It was the best tasting and most exciting recipe to make. I felt really accomplished for making something that's normally a takeout standby. Second was Sun Basket. The recipe seemed unnecessarily complex and the outcome was tasty, but not quite as much as I'd hoped. Bonus points, however, for efforts to recycle packaging, even if you have to ship it back to have it recycled, and also points for sourcing from West Coast farmers. Blue Apron was pretty delicious. The recipe was a little humbling for something that should have been so straightforward. And Blue Apron also had maybe the most packaging of all four. HelloFresh had the least amount of packaging. The recipe was simple and straightforward, but ultimately pretty blah. I had a lot of fun doing this, but I don't, I just don't think that you can get around the fact that I just had a meal shipped to me from across the country. That doesn't feel like getting any closer to the source of your food. But it got me into the kitchen for an entire day, so that's something. There is something particularly humbling about failing at a step of meal preparation that has been entirely set out for you. Did they crack? So like, with training wheels, you fell off the bicycle. Exactly. I didn't break anything, but Maybe I did. Maybe the egg. <laughs> Sorry, too soon. <laughs>